We were happy. Then I saw Muslim brothers coming. I said, I've been waiting for you. Hello, Muslim friends of the world. The decision to convert to a different religion is something quite difficult for someone to make. It is not uncommon for them to undergo inner turmoil and face opposition from their surroundings because their new decision is not supported. Converting to another religion is highly forbidden by any religion. In fact, it is not uncommon for a devout servant of God, such as a priest, to be tempted to convert. Even living in a strictly religious environment, these priests eventually choose a different path from before. Now, for those who are curious, here is the full review as reported from various sources. Ibrahim Richmond was previously known as a Christian pastor with around 100,000 followers in South Africa. However, three months ago, he converted to Islam after a divine voice spoke to him in a dream. His conversion to Islam was also followed by about 100,000 of his followers. We were happy. Then I saw Muslim brothers coming. I said, I've been waiting for you. Now, the former pastor who changed his name to Reverend Abraham Richmond is in Mecca to perform the Hajj pilgrimage at the invitation of King Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud of Saudi Arabia. Last March, in a viral video on the internet, Richmond and thousands of his followers were seen reciting the Shah Ada. Last Sunday, the Saudi government communication center posted another video of Richmond on Twitter, where he shared the experience that led him to accept Islam. In the video, he said, I was a priest for 15 years, and I was the leader of a congregation in a church that had 100,000 followers until I saw that dream. Richmond continued, he was sleeping in a very small room in the church. Then, I heard a divine voice telling me, tell your people to wear white clothes. In the following days, Richmond repeatedly experienced the same dream. Each time the voice grew louder, he recalled. Richmond then went to the church and told his thousands of followers about the dream. Three months ago, I recited the Shaheda in the same church, and they supported what I said and repeated it. Later, I saw a Muslim brother come to us. I told him that I had always been waiting for him. I dreamed he would come here, he said, crying. Regarding his current Hajj pilgrimage, he said, the first time I was invited for Hajj, I wasn't sure. I thought I couldn't go. But now, I am here, following in the footsteps of the Prophet Muhammad, and millions of my followers will follow this step to see the light. Abraham Richmond became part of the Hajj pilgrims who arrived in Mecca as guests of the King Salman Hajj program. He added that Allah made it easy for him on his holy Hajj journey. I am very happy and lucky to be given this opportunity, he said. Another video shared by the Haramain Twitter account showed him arriving in Mecca and performing his first Hajj rituals. More than 1.8 million pilgrims, including 1,660,915 foreigners and 184,130 domestics, climbed Mount Arafat on Tuesday at the peak of the Hajj pilgrimage. They then returned to Mazdalafa, halfway between Arafat and Mina, where they participated in the symbolic stoning of the devil ritual at Jamrat al Aqaba, known as the Stoning of the Devil Ritual and stayed overnight. All pilgrims then returned to Mina, where they sacrificed animals to mark the start of the four-day Eid al adha on Wednesday. Asterisk Pastor Hilarion Hege Asterisk a renowned American Catholic priest, Hilarion Hege, 
decided to convert to Islam, which caused a stir in various foreign media outlets. After embracing Islam, Heggy adopted a new name, said Abdul Latif. In his blog, he revealed several reasons for his conversion to Islam. One of them was like returning home. Heggy stated that converting to Islam felt like returning to his primordial identity. He claimed that this decision was made after years of observing Islam. Asterisk Vladimir Ugriyamov Asterisk Vladimir Ugriyamov is a servant of God who spent 15 years in the Russian Orthodox Church. However, he experienced an event that eventually changed his life and led him to embrace Islam. His introduction to Islam began when he heard about a young Christian woman converting to Islam. He then sought to learn more about Islam as more people were converting. The most interesting aspect of Islam for Vladimir was the simplicity of the concept of monotheism in Islam, which is different from the concept of the Holy Trinity in Christianity. Asterisk Paul Partahap Asterisk Paul Partahap is the husband of influencer Gita Savitri, who once caused a stir on social media by deciding to be child-free. However, Paul Partahap was a former young pastor before he decided to embrace Islam. Paul converted to Islam in 2015, although at that time he admitted he was still in the process of exploring and learning about the world's religions. He was also frequently taught how to perform prayers by Gita until he finally became a Muslim. Asterisk Haroon Asterisk Haroon is a pastor from Mississippi, United States. He grew up in a Christian family. After reaching the age of 20, he became a young pastor. However, one day he had doubts about Jesus. Haroon read the Bible and studied the New Testament, which states that Jesus is God and the Son of God. In short, he met a friend from Saudi Arabia, and from there he began to learn about Islam until he converted. Asterisk Marlon Sename Asterisk a beautiful pastor from Indonesia named Marlon Sename decided to convert to Islam after receiving divine guidance. The Protestant Christian pastor chose Islam as her new religion because she was confused by the number of gods in her previous religion. In the presence of women in the congregation, Marlon Sename recited the two sentences of the Shah Ada. She converted to Islam without any coercion from anyone. Marlon embraced Islam due to the divine guidance given by Allah to her.